how did y'all get together to create this dynamic duo? Like the first, first time y'all met each other. I want to hear that story. I don't doubt we should have seen it, man. 20 G's in a duffel bag, 18 on this piece and chain. From both of y'all. I'ma jump it off, straight up ripping, pop my clipping. Best be wired to the nigga that's tripping. Over the... Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. Man, hey, man, listen, man, check it, man. We got some guys in here today. I'm not even gonna play with y'all about these guys, man. Ever since I started Boss Talk 101, uh, I've been rooting for these guys right here. I started, when I first started, I said, I got to get these dudes on here together. I told both of them that. I told them that when I, when yeah. I first seen them. It was Father's Day. It was around Father's Day and Father's Day tomorrow. Early. I'm giving up our time. <laughs> but I was like, man, y'all bring your sons back. I remember that. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, we got to bring the sons on here. I was trying to figure out how to bring my brothers together to show that fathers, you know, that you got some stand-up dads out here. You know what I mean? And, and some kids that love their fathers. You know what I'm saying? And guess what, man? Check it, man. These boys is here today, man. Mr. Lucci, Mr. Pookie, man. Lay it down. I'm a crook for life. Hey, man. man. Say, man. Man, it's good to have y'all, man. Like I said, this is something I've been wanting to do ever since I started the show. So thank y'all. I appreciate y'all for even coming. I know y'all my dogs. I know y'all rock with me. See, niggas don't really know how, how I am about, about the, the true ones. Yeah, yeah, You know, yeah. And, I, and, and I'm not just capping. Like, it's certain dudes... I just got a lot of respect for, and it's just because I seen the come up and I value the music so much. So again, thank y'all, man. I appreciate y'all, brothers, man. Oh, Mr. Really? Maker, what you got for him today? I gotta find out how did y'all get together to create this dynamic duo? Like the first first time y'all met each other, I want to hear that story. I don't doubt we should have seen it, man. Twenty G's in a duffel bag, eighteen on this piece and chain. From both of y'all. I'ma jump it off, straight up ripping, pop my clipping, best be wired to the nigga that's tripping, over the... Wow. Alright, um, uh, on my end, mm -hmm. on my end, it was straight through Kev and A, but it was through K-Rock too, like, you know what I'm saying, but, uh, Kev and A told me about, about Lucha. You know, I'm doing an album already. We starting. Uh, he told me about it. He told me about K Rock. K Rock, you know, seen him at the barbershop, and, and uh, he liked him. How old were you at this time? I'm 21, probably. Okay, so young. Yeah, I'm about 21, maybe 22. I wow. think 21 though, because it took me a year to do the album. So. And when he said he um, he told you about him because he just thought that y'all would make. A great collab? It, it, it wasn't even me. He was just telling me about, uh, you know, how good he was and, and you know, he had somebody else. And, um, and he brought him he brought him to the studio. Mm. You know, after, after, after that and shit, I heard his first verse. He spit his first verse that I heard him spit. And I was like, God damn. <laughs> Yo, and, and how old was you at the time? I was fifteen. You were fifteen. It was, it was wow. the one with the uh, the bubble, the bubble, bu the bubble lights with the beans. The one you. He can't, he can't forget. remember that. Yeah. He can't remember that shit, man. Well, he man. couldn't forget he it. Right. Cause we never put this verse down. We never, we never, he never put this verse Why? down that he spit. I don't know what, but it I was a bro. It was a. I used to write, you know what I'm saying. It was a bad. It was a bad one. I was like, was, uh, damn. You just learned to write. Yeah, I used to have a lot of verses. You know what I'm saying. So it, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it, was, it, was, it was the shit, bro. It so, was. what made y'all decide to create this duo, though, and stay I mean, together? The people, the people did that. Yeah. Okay. I mean, Kevin, they just brought him in because that's he. He just really trying to get rappers together, together and, and, and and do his thing. Like you know, what I'm saying that's his vision. He, you know, what I'm saying it wasn't. It didn't. It didn't I did none of it work out like that's he planned. Done. Like you know, he started with K Rock, K Rock and C Pone. You know out. what I'm saying? And uh, K-Rock brought me down there just because he basically, really, he's staying with me at this time. You know what I'm saying? He brought me, we, we all in the music. You know what I'm saying? So he brought me down there. I'm, I'm more behind K-Rock and c Pong because that's our rappers in, in the hood. You know, I can rap too. I just started, though. You know what I'm yeah. saying? But they that's who we was behind. You know what I'm saying? They was doing their thing. They introduced me to Kevin. But Mr. Lucci, um, to be called Mr. at 15, 
You know what I'm saying? <laughs> what did you think about that when they first came up with that? Well, shit. Um, did he say Mister when he said? When yeah, he? he talked to me. He told me why. You know what I'm saying? Because uh, you know, I get at the you know Kevin, Kevin, Kevin laced up Mister. You know what I'm saying? K Rock named me Luchi. Cause I used to be, uh, I used to go by Lil J. Okay. You know, my, my government start with a J. Okay. So I'd just be Lil J. And then um, after K Rock heard me rap on the phone, he was just like, What's your name again? He said, He's like, Nah, nigga, your name Lucha. You know what I'm saying? Wow. Cause I never met K Rock in person. I had only met him. He literally oh. just called me on the phone at my, my mom's them house. You know what I'm saying? But, anyways, um, once he did that, once me and Kevin, when we was uh, going, and uh, cause I even got a verse, I was like Lil Lucci and shit like that. And he was like, uh, nah, you know what I'm saying? He say, um, you remember that conversation you had with us about that shit? When he was talking, I know, I, I don't know, I know, yeah, we was, I think we was together. Cause he was just like, um, the way he presented us and rolled us out. Yeah, was yeah, like, yeah, yeah. You don't want to be little nothing. Cause you're going to grow up and be a man one day. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? So you have yeah, to understand you and approach you is how you gonna how you how you gonna be and you gonna be you know presidential so right you know, mister but as, at a young age as you were when he gave you that name mister did that mm -hmm. make you walk in a different you know sometimes you know as you get older and you you watch what well, i watch movies right and they always say be careful of the names that you give your children or you name yourself because mm -hmm. you have to live up to that name did that name mister before your name make you have to walk like with more responsibility did it make you feel that way 15 nah. at 15 no nah. nah, it was me yeah they didn't say nothing to uh Kobe and lebron when he went to the league it's at, at 18. i just got in the league early in the rap game mm -hmm. because but i was but I, mister I was wasn't in front of his name yeah nobody but, you had yeah, older but, people calling you mister yeah i know I know. You know, it was know. the era. <laughs> Did it then. make you feel? It was the era then, though, in the Misters. Mr. Know, Mike. Yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. we it was, it was kind of in that Mr. Mr. Big, Mr. Big. You know, they they call him Mr. Big. It was kind of in that era. It was oh, a Mr. Okay. thing going on I'm back on, then. I'm on it. I was on Mr. Pookie Club. Mr. My, Mr. My Star Face. Oh, okay. You know what I'm yeah. saying? My daddy Ooh. used to call me that Mr. Mr. Pookie. Oh, really? You know, and I just. So that's how you got that name. I just used my regular name for one, and then Mr. was just. It was just me, okay, got you it. You know what I'm saying? So. Wow. You know, um, when you think about the Rippler, Diabolical, like you guys doing those projects, y'all, y'all, were y'all both on both of those projects? Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's kind of like y'all interchanged the. Uh, how was that? Like you, knowing that you had your own project coming out when it was coming out, how exciting was that to do the fir you know your first projects? Shit. Mm, me, it was ooh. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gon' talk.